The adjustment of comb plate impact switches on all escalators is important in order to ensure safe and reliable operation of the equipment. This tool has been designed to make the adjustment and calibration process easier and accurate. Before beginning, use the instructions included with the kit to familiarize yourself with the various parts and accessories. Note that this tool must be used with the Kone Pressure Gauge Kit, purchased separately. First step in assembling the kit is to slide the jack piston into the rear retainer bracket. Then install and tighten the front retainer clips. Next, screw the jack piston extension head out from the jack piston as shown. Once that is completed, you mount the assembly bracket into the jack piston. In order to perform the test on the escalator, comb plates need to be removed either at the side or middle of the escalator landing, depending on the escalator make and model. Once removed, attach the appropriate comb weldment from the kit using the hardware removed from the comb segment. To use the test kit for horizontal switch calibration, attach the end angle bracket under the base weldment. Then attach one of the longer cables to the assembly bracket. Position the kit so that the end angle is braced against the deck plate and attach the cable end to the comb weldment using the cable adapter plate if necessary. Connect the pressure gauge to the quick connect fitting on the hydraulic jack. Using the test kit's included switch calibration table, measure the hydraulic pressure and correlate it to the force in pounds it takes to trigger the horizontal comb impact switch. Note. Hydraulic pressure readings must be taken while slowly and evenly increasing the jack pressure, stopping when the switch is triggered. For calibrating and testing a vertical comb plate impact switch, the kit is used with the supplied wooden blocks to span the entire length of the comb plate. Sometimes, on escalators that feature a large comb plate, it will be necessary to attach a base assembly extension in order to span the entire plate. The extension is attached using the included splice plate and hardware. Once the kit is positioned correctly, attach a small cable to the comb weldment between the two quick release pins. For accurate settings of the vertical trip force, make sure to align the pull cable with the end of the comb segment tool, oriented vertically. Connect the pressure gauge to the quick connect fitting on the hydraulic jack. Using the test kit's included switch calibration table, measure the hydraulic pressure and correlate it to the force in pounds it takes to trigger the vertical comb impact switch. As before, hydraulic pressure readings must be taken while slowly and evenly increasing the jack pressure, stopping when the switch is triggered. Make sure to read and understand the detailed instructions and calibration table included in the kit, and always refer to the manufacturer's installation and maintenance instructions for specific escalator models when using this kit to make sure that you're adjusting the comb plate impact switches to their proper safe settings.